Merseyside police marked a major milestone with their topping out ceremony at the construction site of their new headquarters. A really happy day after so many rather bleak days working through the epidemic. Really early on, the developers Wilmot Dixon worked with their suppliers and contractors on site to figure out the safest way to deliver this project with welfare of the staff right at the top of the agenda. For Merseyside police, the most important thing is that the, the new building will save their budget a quarter of a million pounds a year in comparison to the cost of running our old headquarters at Canning Place. That's really important because that means a quarter of a million pounds going to the front line every year. We've sort of done it in a non-judgmental way. If people aren't happy to come back to work, they don't need to. Whatever their concerns are, we can come up with a way of addressing them. Um, and a big part of us being able to respond to COVID has been the support from our customers, like in this case Merseyside Police. But the sort of things that we've ended up doing, giving a bit more space for people to work in, additional canteen facilities, um, we've implemented uh, checks for everybody coming in, temperature checks, some, some, some questions, and providing a, a listening ear to anybody who's got any concerns. So I, I think really it's been a, a team effort. We've got a team here that, that wants to deliver this project for the customer and go on and do more. We then asked the police commissioner about the force's response and reaction to the Black Lives Matter movement in the city. Merseyside Police will always enable peaceful protests. It's our civic right and it's their duty to allow protests that are peaceful. Um, what is really important though is that they stay peaceful but I think this is an opportunity for us to re-examine our society and to ask the questions that we should have been asking anyway.